Grapple? Yeah. What is Grapple? Handsome. 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 You. Handsome. I'm me handsome. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Salamat. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to mix some of the rice here together with the broth because the broth is very delicious. All right, I have left Malaysia and after a short stop here in Bangkok, Thailand, I'm going to a new country on my journey to visit every country in Southeast Asia. I am very excited for this upcoming journey. Feel free to join me today. Wow, the last time I was at this airport was in January and compared to January, it's super busy here now. But that's actually nice. Nice to see uh, the world is coming back to normal. Tourism is coming back to normal. I mean, look how many people are here. Wow, really cool. But yeah, that also probably means there's gonna be a longer waiting queue than the last time I was here. All right, I'm flying with Thai Airways. And yeah, the waiting line is not that long actually. So yeah, shouldn't take uh, too much time. Uh, only one, right? Only one, yes. No power bank, no battery inside. No. All right, now it's uh, 12.3 kilo. All right, check it out. The big statue here has a mask as well now. That's funny. And yeah, check-in completed. It was now, I don't know, five minutes waiting time. So very fast, actually, easy, smooth. Whew, I'm excited. Let's go. Okay, up and up. And I have officially left Thailand and I really have to say thumbs up for the efficiency here at the airport. Although it's very busy here, everything is fast and smooth. They have a lot of staff here, so Thailand seems to be really prepared for the amount of tourists here. All right, I have to go to gate C2. Should be this way. Sabadika. All right, time to board. We are a little bit late, it's already 15 minutes after the scheduled departure time, but that's okay. I'm not in a rush today. And yeah, the flying time is like three, three and a half hours, so it's not a really long flight, but also not a short flight. Thank you. Oh, this is a huge plane. I didn't expect that the plane for a three hour flight to be that huge. And yeah, while we are flying, I would like to tell you about today's video sponsor, which is Surfshark VPN. And if you don't know what's a VPN, it stands for Virtual Private Network, and it lets you virtually change the location of your phone or your laptop to basically anywhere in the world. And by doing that, it can encrypt the data that is sent between your phone or computer and the internet. By using a VPN, your data and your personal information are safer and no one can steal them, which is especially important when you are using a lot of public Wi-Fi's or hotel Wi-Fi's like I do when I'm traveling. So no matter where I am going, I always feel way more secure about my data when I'm connected to a VPN. And it can be used for more than just security. With just one click, you can virtually change your location and unlock content that is geo-restricted and not available in your country. Watching German football highlights, for example, is only possible for me when I'm connected to a German VPN because the content is not available to watch outside of Germany. Netflix is another great example. Just virtually change your location with a VPN and you have access to totally different Netflix content libraries like the US or the UK version of Netflix. And yeah, my favorite VPN service is Surfshark VPN and I can highly recommend it. It is the only VPN to offer one account for unlimited devices. And if you would like to check out Surfshark as well, you can use the link in my description or on the pinned comment. And if you use the promo code Ken, you can get 83% off plus three extra months for free. And they also have a 30 day money back guarantee. So you can test it out without any risk. Thanks to Surfshark for sponsoring this video. And now let's enjoy the flight. That was a rough arrival. We flew through a thunderstorm and it's pouring rain outside. And even earlier we had a lot of turbulences as well. But yeah, we made it. It's already dark outside. Bye bye. bye, -bye. Thank you very much. Huh?
Can Hello. you show your one-hill pass first? Yes. Thank you. Okay. Thank you very much. All right. Welcome to Manila. Welcome to the Philippines. They just checked. Hello. Um, the health pass. Before you fly here, you need to uh, fill out an online registration form where you have to upload your vaccination certificate, stuff like that. So they just checked that. And now there is one problem that I have. Um, in order to enter the Philippines, you need a return ticket, which I forgot to buy. I just remember it during the flight. So we have immigration here. And I checked already if the airport Wi-Fi is working so that I can buy a ticket now on the spot. But the Wi-Fi is not working. Let me try it again. Um, because yeah, it would be good if I can get a ticket before I go to immigration because they will uh, most likely ask me for the ticket. So we have quite a few uh, airport Wi-Fi's for free available here, but I just tried them all. <laughs> They're all not working. So that is not uh, helping me. Yeah, obviously I don't have mobile data because I don't have a SIM card. Um, I actually also tried to uh, use my uh, German SIM card, but it's not working here. So that might become a problem with immigration now. Okay, I just spoke with a lady on the counter behind me and she gave me access to one Wi-Fi here, which seems to work, yeah. Get a lot of notifications now, okay. So let's see if I can now uh, book a flight out of here uh, on the spot. Okay, successfully bought a ticket, which is going to be a throwaway ticket because I'm not sure yet uh, where I want to go after the Philippines and when I want to go. So I just bought a random ticket. Thank you. All right, let's see if uh, I will be allowed to enter the Philippines. And I am in. And you know what's funny now? He didn't even ask for my return ticket. So all the hassle to uh, get Wi-Fi and buy a return ticket on the spot wasn't even needed. <laughs> but okay. Um, yeah, I am in now. I have a 30-day tourist visa on arrival for free. You don't have to pay for it. At least as a German, I'm not sure if that is the same for every country. But um, I'm going to extend the visa. I already asked the officer if I can do that. I can extend another month and I think even another month after that. So my plan is to stay at least two full months here in the Philippines, in Manila and then exploring around. Ah, there's my bag. So there's a lot of content coming from the Philippines on my channel in the next weeks and next two months at least. Um, so, but now, yeah, I have to go into the city. Um, go this way? Okay, thank you. Um, yeah, that's gonna be interesting right now. First time taxi ride here in Manila in the Philippines. Um, but first, uh, it's a new country. That means I need a new SIM card and I need cash. So let's see. Oh. Do you know where I can find a SIM card? SIM card there. Over there. What is the best? What is the best SIM card company here? I think Smart. 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 Okay, I'll check it out. Thank you very much. All right, SIM card, cash, taxi, and maybe learn a few new words. If you arrive in a new country, it's always good to uh, learn a few basic words. I know Salamat already, which is thank you. I know Kamusta Ka, which is how are you? Hello, I think it's just hello. Uh, maybe I should get cash first because I don't even have the money to, uh, to buy. Oh, there's an ATM here. Oh, arriving in a new country is always uh, exciting and stressful. So let's see. So the currency here is pesos. And 55 pesos, I think, equals one US dollar. Um, all right. Let's see if the ATMs are working here with my card. <laughs> okay, and I got Filipino pesos. The notes look like this. What's a 1000 pesos? That should be like $20 then. So, okay, let's use the money to uh, get a SIM card. Yes, yeah, so I'm going with a recommendation from the officer over there. He said SMART is the number one. And I did research about SIM cards here before and I remember the name smart coming up in my research hello thank you yes, sir. Yes, sir. um do you have unlimited packages we don't have an uh, unlimited here What's in the 
only consumable. In the whole Philippines, no unlimited. Yeah. Ah, okay. There's a unlimited, but you can go to the mall if you want. Well, okay, but that's almost yeah. like unlimited. Yeah, sir. Almost like. Um, so this is the price. Yes, sir. This is internet only. Internet with phone calls. Oh, I don't need phone calls. Yeah, just, sir. just internet. Um, then I take this one. This one? Are you yeah. Sure? Seventy-two phone? gigabyte for like yes, twenty-eight dollars, something like that. Okay. 60 days in uh, call and text all network here in the For so 60 days, yeah, okay. 72 gigabytes of internet, no expiry. Okay. And if empty, I can top up again, right? Yes, sir. Okay. Oh, and I just got my first subscriber in the Philippines. <laughs> my first two subscribers. Well, actually, I, I have a few Filipino subscribers already. I uh, saw some comments from Filipinos before. But, uh, how do you say thank you here? Salamat. Salamat, right? Yes. And salamat po? Salamat po is more polite, right? Yes, yeah, sir. Okay, and, and kamusta ka? That's how are you, right? Oh, good, okay. Okay, so hello. Hello is hello, I think. Kamusta ka? Salamat. So the most important words already uh, figured out. All right, I have a SIM card. It is now already 9 o'clock local time. It's getting late here. And they do have Grab in the Philippines as well. So my hotel is somewhere here i think it's close to the city center but uh, of course we're gonna explore around the city in the next days in the next videos so a car is 349 pesos which what's that like seven seven eight dollars something like that um sounds okay for me the the ride is like half an hour i checked it earlier already let's see if grab is working as smooth as in Thailand or Malaysia here. All right, change of plans. I couldn't find the Grab, waited for a few minutes now. Maybe it's the same as in Bangkok when it's rainy weather, it's not that easy to get a Grab, especially at a popular place like the airport. But one of the officers told me there's a Grab desk over here. Never heard about a Grab desk before, but indeed there is one. Let's see if I can get a Grab here. And you see the blue bulletin board there? Yeah. Yeah, you can ask them. Okay, thank you very much. Thank okay. you. Okay, she also told me that at the moment it's really hard to get a grab. A lot of waiting time. So she actually recommended that I'm getting a regular taxi. Okay. Yes, sir. Excuse me, where can I get a taxi? Is this Mita taxi? Yes. They use Mita as well? Yes. Okay. I'm asking if they actually use Mita because I'm coming from Thailand where as a foreigner it's sometimes not easy to get a taxi that uses a meter but I don't know how that is in the Philippines here maybe it's really different here ah, I'm so excited to be here in a new country the Philippines has been on my list for yeah since I started traveling around Southeast Asia Anna can I get a taxi here taxi taxi where are going um, boarding pass I don't know the area of the so, boarding pass. Sir. Boarding pass? Yeah. For my flight? Yeah. Ma'am? Hop in. Ermita? Ermita, that's the, the name of the town? Very big. Big hotel? Yeah. Or me big? <laughs> you play basketball there? Oh no, I don't play. Uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> How much is it? A meter, okay. Okay, thank you. No, I don't, I don't oh, play basketball. Very tall. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I feel like I'm in the USA now because when I was in the USA, I'm from Germany. Germany, yes. Thank you very much. I'm very happy to be here. My first time in the Philippines. Really? Yes. Ooh. You're a blogger? Uh, yes, I make YouTube videos. Huh? YouTube videos. Videos. YouTube videos. Oh, wait, it's the wrong side because I'm a uh, Philippines driving on the right side. Uh, so used to uh, sitting on that side because Malaysia and Thailand is the other side. Okay. Ah. Alright, what I wanted to say is that uh, I feel like I'm in the USA because when I was in the USA everybody kept asking me if I'm playing basketball. Basketball is very popular here, right? Yes. Sir. Number one sport? Yeah, in the Philippines. Okay, then I need to get a Filipino basketball t-shirt. <laughs> because I like to get t-shirts of the, of the popular sport of the countries. How many days stay here, sir? How many days stay here? Uh, two months. Oh, really? Yes, I want to say two months. Maybe three months. Oh. I want to uh, travel all around. <laughs> I will stay two weeks in Manila. Uh -huh. And after that, I don't know yet. <laughs> no plan yet. No plan yet, yeah. Spontaneous and 
tree. Oh, so cool. And this is like a public bus here called Jeepney. Oh, wow. I oh, definitely want to ride one of them in the next days. Oh, there's a little market here. Oh. Okay, how much was it? 200 something, right? Fine. Just give me a 200. And you want 100 too? That's okay. That's okay. Thank, Thank you very much. Salamat. Salamat. Thank you. Okay. So I already learned the first thing. Uh, meter taxi seems to be cheaper than Grab. The price on the meter was 200 something, but the price on Grab was 300 something. So it seems like meter taxis are cheaper here, which is good to know. Oh, thank you very much. Hello. Good evening. I have a booking for Ken. Yeah. All right, so I'm staying at the Hop In Hotel, which is a chain that I know already from Thailand. I stayed uh, in a few Hop In Hotels in Thailand already, so I know the chain and uh, so far I was always happy with it. Um, let's have a quick look at the room. And I can't open the door. Excuse me, I can't open the door. But you were able to, uh, to try to tap it on the door. The yeah, like the, the black panel. It's just a uh, black. Uh, sorry, it's red. Yeah, the, the red light. Uh, oh, it's working now. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Salamat. All right. Actually, the room looks exactly like the hop in rooms uh, I had in Thailand. Yeah, that's what I like about chain hotels. Always the same, so you know what you get. Okay, so this is my hotel room. Let's have a quick look just to give you an impression of my uh, yeah, first hotel in the Philippines. Yeah, it's nothing special, but um, since I'm going to spend the next days out in the city exploring, um, basically all I need is a clean, proper place to sleep, a desk where I can uh, do some work, some editing work, some behind the scenes work. All right, I would say uh, see you in the morning. All right, and it is the next morning now. Actually, pretty late morning already. I uh, slept rather late yesterday. Maybe also because of the time difference, because it's... Yeah, my inner clock is one hour earlier. But nevertheless, I am excited to have a first walk around, trying to find some... Yeah, some breakfast, something to eat. I have no idea about uh, the food here yet, but I am very excited to... Uh, try my way around in the next weeks i don't know do they have uh, street food stalls here like in thailand maybe some fruit stalls that would be nice actually oh i think i see some stalls over there all right i even see we have the ocean over there we have some uh, some restaurants here but that looks more like like fast food change not really that hello do you have something to eat here? What are you selling here? Hello, I'm looking for some food. Yes, 65. Well, what is this food? Food is anoparis. Anoparis? Okay, so, no. Is it uh, like okay. noodles? Oh, uh, beep. Beep? Okay. Yes. Do you like? I don't know. Yeah. My first time in the Philippines. Ah. I don't know. But is it good? Oh, good. good? Okay, uh, how much? Uh, 55. 50 pe 55? Oh, 55 only. Okay, I would like to get one. Okay. Yes, please. Okay, so uh, maybe it's going to look like this here. Ah, is it like this? Ah. So it's, I see rice here, I see noodles. Okay, not sure what I will get now. Ah. Okay, rice. Is it rice and noodles? Yes. Uh, oh. yes. Okay, so we have a uh, right rice here. Yes. Ah, this is meat. Yes. Beef. Um, beef? Okay. Yes. Beef. Okay. I like I like beef. Beef oh. and noodles. And noodles? Yeah. You mix everything together. Okay, a, a little bit. A little bit. Ah, I think this is a uh, fat, fat parts. Yes. Okay. Fats. And noodles. 
Dapat kinain. Hindi, ano yan? 75 lang. 50 plus 35, 85, 95. 85? 95 only. 95. Okay, and we have a lot of broth here or sauce. Ah. I can eat here? Yes. Yes? All right. So I think that answers my question if they have street food here. This looks like a street food cart. I can eat right here. What was the name? Paris. Paris. Party. So we have ah some uh, some spices. Yes. This one the best. Ingredients. Ingredients. Yes. Okay, okay. But uh, spicy. Yes, spicy. Oh. Yeah. I need to be and careful with spicy. Calamansi. This one. Onion rings. Ah, onion rings. I like onion rings. Calamansi. Ah, lemon. You you put lemon. over? Yeah. Begin with your bawa. Ah, this is uh, onion. Ano yung this na bawa? Onion. Onion. Onion, right? Bawang. It's the same word in Malaysia for uh, onion. Ah, okay. So you you put it on on here? Yes. Okay. Oh yeah. I actually like these crispy onions. 35 plus 55. And this one? Uh, 100 only pesos. 35 uh, 55 100. 100 all together. Okay, okay. Okay. Where are you from? I'm from Germany. And my uh, first time in the Philippines. Wow. Today is the first day. Are you married in the Philippines? Or not, not married, not married. Yeah. Not yet. I'm single, yes. Mm. Okay. Do you also have something to drink here? Right, do you begin to drink? Ah, uh, here's drink. Lemon. 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 What about no, tea or coffee? Pop coffee. Coffee? Do you coffee? Coffee, yes. No, Just coffee? Coffee. I don't know, do you, do you drink tea or coffee in the Philippines? Yeah, coffee. Yeah. coffee I don't know yeah. what's more popular here. Yeah. Yeah. Some coffee? Coffee. You, you sell coffee here? Mix oh. Yeah. Mixed coffee? Yes? Yeah. Okay. Some order. How, how much is one coffee? 15 only. 15 pesos only. Okay, okay, one coffee please. Yes, okay. Uh, uh, original? Original? Yes, coffee original. Or Red. You have a Filipino coffee? coffee? Yes. From Nescafe Philippines? Yes. But Nescafe is... Nescafe. Okay, okay, I take Nescafe. I'm not sure if that's uh, Filipino coffee, but that's okay. Okay, uh, I'll try this now. Okay. Okay. So I guess this is just uh, normal yeah. rice. Yeah. And then we have the noodles. Actually, it looks very slimy. I like that, actually. We have uh, some beef parts here. Oh. Wow, delicious. Mm. Yes, yeah, so that's very good. Delicious. Mm. Delicious. The, the broth is very uh, rich in flavors. It's a very thick broth. Very nice to eat, actually. Mm. Delicious. Yes, it's very good. How do you say delicious in Filipino? How to say delicious? Masarap. Masarap? Masarap. Ah, thank you very much. Sir. What, what's the name of your blog? Uh, and then, Blogger. And then, I see my Facebook. Ken Abroad. Kenny. Ken. Ken. K-E-N. Kenny. How are they? K-E-N. K-E-N. And Broad. then, Abroad. Broad. B. A B R O A D. Broad. On YouTube. YouTube. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so we have a. I think it's an instant coffee, but uh, that's okay. I make videos about Philippines. Okay, a little bit junior. Ah, builders also. Hmm? Builders also. I mean builders like this. Yes, I like places like this. I like to try the local food. Hmm? So, uh, coffee and my first meal here in the Philippines. 
Very happy about that. Um, Masaram. Masaram. Delicious. Delicious. That's a very important word to learn. Masaram. Oh. Wapo. Hmm? Wapo. Wapo? Yeah. What is Wapo? Handsome. 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 Oh. Ananda. <laughs> Beautiful. Beautiful. Yeah. You you mean the food? The food is handsome. Paris. Yeah, not delicious. Delicious. Handsome. You handsome. Ah, me handsome. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Salamat. 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 Thank you. Actually, wap, huh? Maganda. Maganda. Beautiful. Beautiful. That's very similar, like Spanish. Ah no. In Spanish is wap, 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 Minda lang lang mo. Yeah. Ah, from, uh, from Wapa. No, Visayas. Ah, okay, okay. Manila, Tagalog. Tagalog. Ah, okay. Tagalog. And then South Philippine, you speak Minda. Minda. Visaya is Wapa. 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 Uh, Manila is Maganda. Ah, you're different uh, English, uh, dialects. Beautiful. Ah, okay, okay. Okay, so I think they have different dialects here in the Philippines, dialects. Mm. What I'm going to do now is, I'm going to mix some of the rice here together with the broth because the broth is very delicious. Mm. Name your channel, your channel. What is the name like that? Mm. Ken Abroad. Ken? 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 So we also have these uh, super nice pieces of beef here. In the hmm? I, I can show you. How old are you? What do you think? Uh, what, 25? 25. Oh, I'm 31. 31, yes. I can see what I'm done. <laughs> I look more young. <laughs> you travel in Palawan? After Manila, maybe. Now Manila. Weeks. How much you get? 100. 100. 100? And coffee. And coffee I pay here? Yeah. Okay. Coffee? How much? 100. 100. Oh, I come here. Okay, uh, salamat. Thank you very much. Okay, <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> All right, that was my first proper meal in the Philippines and it was really good. Masarap, delicious. So I'm paying my coffee here now. Ah, you have different coffees here, right? Yes, yes. Ah, yeah, okay, okay. You here every morning? Yes. Okay, maybe tomorrow morning I come back for more coffee. Okay, okay. okay, thank you very much. Thank you, thank you. And now I would like to see the pictures. Can you have a look? Because they have very beautiful uh, oil painting. Ah, very beautiful oil paintings here. And this looks like a place in the Philippines that I am very curious to uh, visit. After my stay here in Manila, I would like to see some beautiful places like this here. Ah, this is Boracay? Boracay, yes. Ah, okay, that's one of the popular spots here in the Philippines. Okay, and we have many of these beautiful pictures here. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, salamat. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye bye. Oh, luckily, it's always nice. Oh, before I uh, continue talking, I see something here. Ah, oh, hello. You have ice cream? Ice cream. Oh, what ice cream do you have? 25. 25. Can I get one, one, one. cone? One, uh, one. one. But what flavor do you have? Uh, Basso. Basso. Um, no, no, in this cigar, cone. cone, in cone, yeah. Uh, cone. Papa. But um, what flavor do you have? Vanilla, chocolate, uh, avocado, avocado. Okay. Ah, okay. Um, can I get this one? Cookies and cream. Cookies? Oreo. Oreo? Okay, one one Oreo, please. One. Okay, one here. Papa. Papa. Uh, in, in cone, yes, please. Mm, one. Twenty-five. Twenty. Okay, okay. Okay. Uh, yeah, just this one, yes. Okay. Yeah, because uh, as you can probably see, uh, 
it's uh, bright sun shining, it's very hot here actually. So uh, this lovely ice cream man here comes uh, as needed, or as much needed. Hello! Oh, oh no, thank you. No, no. Ah, no, thank you, no, thank you. No need this one. Thank you, thank you, no. Okay. All right. Thank you very much. Salamat. Salamat. Thank you. Welcome. Okay. Very good. Mass set up. Mass set up. Thanks. Oh, nice. He's walking around with a little cart like this here. Oh. Okay. Ah, oh, that's very cool. Um, before I saw the ice cream man, I wanted to say something. Ah, no, thank you. No, thank you. No, not looking for for some uh, fake jewelry. Mm -hmm. Oh, the ice cream is melting super fast. Oh. Oh. But um, yeah, what I wanted to say is, it's always very nice when the first people you meet on your first day in a new country are super welcoming and friendly, like uh, the ladies at the food stall. Also like off camera, I wasn't filming the, the whole time I was eating there and also off camera they were very chatty, asking me lots of questions and yeah overall just a really nice experience uh, to meet friendly people right away when you are in a new country, always loved it. So my first impressions of the people here is amazing so far. And yeah, if you are from Manila or if you are from the Philippines or if you have been here before, feel free to let me know any recommendations that you might have in the comment section down below. And yeah, feel free to subscribe to the channel to join the journey around the Philippines in the next at least two months. And I'm going to explore more around the city now, but that is going to be in the next episode. So make sure you are coming back for that. And if you are curious to see my previous video where I had some amazing food in Bangkok, Thailand, then check out the video right here. Stay healthy, stay positive, and then see you on the next episode from Manila. Ciao, guys.